Okay, right here you can see a fleet of Caterpillar 789B off-road mining trucks. The 789 was first introduced by Caterpillar in 1986, two years following the introduction of the smaller 785 model in 1984. By the time both trucks were upgraded to the B series, both the 785 and the larger 789 had become world-class leaders and accounted for virtually 50% of all world mining truck sales. Now, let's go and get a closer look at a 789B. The 789 was upgraded to the newer B series in the fall of 1992 which featured many mechanical improvements over the original 789A model, such as improved engine efficiency, improved mechanical drivetrain, improved rim pull, more efficient braking and retarding, and also a more comfortable operator's cab. The 789B is powered by a Caterpillar 3516 EUI turbocharged and after-cooled V16 diesel engine that produces 1,705 horsepower for this big truck. This is the exact same engine with the exact same power ratings as on the older 789A model. However, the engine in the newer B model featured an electronic unit injection system which increased fuel economy and helped reduce emissions. And right here you can see the grease barrel for the central lubrication system. From here you can get a good view looking underneath a 789B. You can see the front axle, the steering cylinders, and tie rods. The engine on this truck connects to a six-speed electronically controlled automatic transmission, which you can see right here. Mounted on the right side of this truck is the hydraulic oil reservoir tank, which holds 240 gallons of hydraulic oil. And here you can see one of the hoist cylinders to raise and lower the dump box. And on the left side of the truck sits an 851 gallon diesel fuel tank, which you can see right here. Okay, now let's go up on top of this big cap. From here you can get a good overview of the top deck on a 789B. Mounted on the right side of this truck is the air tank for the air system, 
and next to it is the steering hydraulic oil tank which holds 34 gallons of oil and all the red canisters that you see here are for the fire suppressant system now let's go and check out the operator's cab From here you can get a good overview inside the operator's cab of the 789B. Okay, this hand lever that you see over here on my right side is the gear shift for the transmission. This is in the neutral position right here. You push forward to put this truck in reverse and then pull back to six forward speeds. On the control panel that you see over here on my right side are switches for the key to start the truck, windshield wipers, and the parking brake switch. On this control panel you see out in front on the dash you can see other switches to work other various functions on the truck. Out in front you can see all the gauges to monitor this truck while it's running. You can see the speedometer and the tachometer. The 789B is equipped with a Caterpillar auto retarding control system, which optimizes brakes on downhill runs and torque converter lockup results in more efficient direct drive for higher travel speeds, allowing the 789 to cruise along at a top speed of 35 miles per hour. This hand lever that you see over here below the steering wheel on the right side controls the retarder. The second hand lever that you see here on the left side is for the emergency or secondary retarding system. This hand lever that you see down here on my left side below the seat controls the dump box to raise, hold, float, and lower it. And from here you can get a crystal clear view of what the operator would see if he were driving a 789B. If you look to the right of the operator's seat, you can see the trainer's seat. And the noise level inside the cab of the 789B is rated at 80 decibels. And to help give you an idea of the size of a 789B, this truck measures 18 feet tall from the ground to the top of the operator's cab, 26 feet 2 inches wide, and has a rated payload capacity ranging between 170 and 195 tons. Due to the overwhelming success of the 785 and 789 models, Caterpillar entered the 240-ton off-highway truck market in 1991 when they launched the 793 model. The 789B would go on to later be upgraded to the newer C model in 1998, featuring an improved 3516B EUI diesel engine, boosting 1,791 horsepower. But there they are a fleet of Caterpillar 789B off-road mining trucks.